<clears throat> it's 7.14 right now, and I started having contractions um, around 5.45 for every five minutes, and they last about 60 seconds. Um, and I just concentrate through them the way that I do, like, normal stuff, like if I have pains and stuff. I'm just leaning over the bed and stuff right now, so. Yeah, just getting ready for her to get here um, she's coming I think so excited but I can't really talk so I don't it, just because the way I deal with pain I need to be quiet I need to concentrate I can't talk it shakes up the concentration breaks it and I just need to focus Mm -hmm. Let's see. I'll see if we can get a contraction on here. You guys can to see. <coughs> oh, Dad Sanders is on his way home from work. I told him he has to come home because I can't like I can't text anymore. I can't talk on the phone. I just need to concentrate. And they're so close together. I need. Oh, I could just scan it. I'm listening to like um forest nature animal sounds because I can't listen to music because like it's making me too emotional. <laughs> I was about to cry like I'm so excited. I don't know what to do with like I just feel like so much and so I need to concentrate. Um I think I've I think one's about to come. So, yeah, I just had to turn off the music and just listen to sound. Kind of figure out what's working for me. If I need to turn that off, I'll just turn it off. Okay. Okay, that was one. <laughs> so, I guess I'll see you guys later. Oh. Hi, Mom. <laughs> hey, guys. You haven't seen me since, not yesterday, but the day before. Um, the third, that's when I went into labor. So, um, I had her... Um, from beginning to end, um, I had about a nine hour labor. And so she was born um, the same day at 2.48. And like, we're still at the hospital. So we go home today, fingers crossed. Um, I didn't get an epidural or anything. I did it. Um, the hardest thing, they just want me breakfast. Let me show you what I gotta eat. But yeah, the hardest thing about this whole thing, I did the labor with no epidural and stuff, but getting her to latch on, that is most important to me. And so we're having a little issue. So she's a little bit tongue-tied, and hopefully they correct that today before we go home, and then everything will be fine because my boobs are so tender right now. It's nasty. I can't even eat it. It's not food. I'm hungry, but... Um, she might get up in a second. I have to feed her, but I have to do like a labor and delivery story time or Q and A so I can like answer everybody's questions and stuff like that. But man, it was tough. These nasty.
do too. Um, she's a good baby. She don't cry. Um, she's just good. I love her. Um, Dad Sanders, he's right here. That's his shoulder. And his head is like right here. Oh, that was her hand sticking up under, under her blanket. But he did amazing helping. But I am the kind of person that when I'm in pain, I can't be touched. So, unfortunately, I have to like, don't touch me and don't talk. No sound like I can't. Oh, my gosh. <sighs> Um, after I had her, there was no tearing or anything. I, it wasn't, it, it doesn't like burn when I pee. Like I thought it was going to, like everybody says it's going to burn. It's, it doesn't. Um, to my arms are really sore though. I feel like I've been boxing. Like I was getting beat up in my arm and then woke up the next morning. You know how you lift weights, you wake up the next day or you work out and you're just like sore because you did a hardcore. That's how I feel today. Um, and it's, it was two days postpartum um man we love her we've been working together with her um it's great i can't wait to go home and get in my own bed though because these mattresses are not cutting it they only have one pillow for me one pillow for him like ain't no pillows here i don't know but like i just want to go home and be in our own environment um i when i was having contractions i would like pull these Pull them in and like hold on so like my arms my shoulder blades my whole back hurts like everything is just like so tender and last night AJ was like rubbing my like oh it just was like a nice feeling and I thought it was gonna soothe me during labor it's it's soothing after <laughs> but yeah I'm just real tired and I just wanted to get a video clip before we leave I'll probably do like show you guys the room that we're in. Oh my god, we was walking because I have to get up and walk, make sure um, I don't get like a blood clot or anything. Um, up to six weeks postpartum, I need to be up walking and stuff. And I do get up and walk and straighten up the room and stuff like that. So I've been lazy because like I'm not in pain or anything. I just get up and do stuff. It's just uncomfortable when I get up and stuff still. And my arms are so sore and I feel my uterus contracting and stuff like that whenever she's nursing or even when she's not so you know there's that but other than that I'm great but we saw this other corner room I think that's what I was telling y'all the room is so big but we should have had that room in this little hot little box but it's warm for the baby though she's got so much hair and her hat keeps coming off her head it's so annoying y'all I'm so hungry oh my gosh Ooh, whoever cooked the bacon yesterday, it was not chewy at all. It was just like little flaky crisps. But today, got a little bounce to it. All right. But I'm going to get up, clean up and stuff because we're supposed to be going home today. So I just need to make sure she'll need to eat. I'll probably feed her before I get up and do anything just so that she'll be like good. <clears throat> I'll see you guys later and then I'll, I'll be vlogging this stuff a little more when I get home but this was a really like intimate time and I don't want to like put all my business out there because this is still an intimate time for my family we're like this is important some people don't know when to cut off your private time or public time and totally not one of those no, I'm not trying to be like no Kylie Jenner or whoever else anybody wants to say, but I'm not going to be like posting her all over social media and stuff like that because we have the choice to put ourselves on social media. She didn't choose that for herself. So if you see her in a vlog, you see her, and if you don't, then you just don't. If you see her posted somewhere, then you do. If you don't, you don't really like. Um, but people that like I talk to on a day to day basis or like certain people I um, have seen her what she looks like and stuff but everybody else we don't talk so it's not your business basically okay I'm done being boring I'll probably 
um, film a little bit more later after I get home and show you guys how we kind of set everything up. getting ready to be discharged me and my little itty bitty who's sitting right here and uh we're just packing up the room so i look a hot mess <laughs> i've been sitting here talking to this camera and i thought i was recording this whole time anyways like i was saying so we got the room like basically finished cleaning and stuff like that so I'm probably gonna like try and straighten that up and then take like all the extra sheets off of that and off the bed um, here. And I'll like pile them up for them, you know, make their job a little bit easier because they were great. They helped us out, helped me take care of my baby. Okay, I did everything for her, she ain't gonna know. <laughs> but yeah, so we'll be, we'll be out of here in a couple minutes anyway. So, and I'm gonna have to sit on the wheelchair and then hold her. So I probably won't get that on camera, but when we get in the car, I might video chat y'all, I don't know. I mean, not video chat, record, whatever. Yeah, we came ready to go. Anybody need some pampers? Bloop, they free. Oh, you can't, you can't really see them. Gave us some free diapers, but I'm cloth diapering, so. But yeah, so, can't wait to get home to my own bed. But let me hurry up, cause um, AJ had to go to the car. She was about to start whining. Yeah, we gotta get home. I got it. Okay, so I'm back home, and we've been home for a couple hours now. And I just got up from a nap, and it was amazing getting to sleep in my own bed. Dad Sanchez is over there knocked out. Tiny baby's in my arms. Um, she's been sleeping for hours. Um. So she's gonna be hungry in a little bit. I know she is, but um, I know I'm just really excited to get to do this at home because like if there's so many interruptions in the hospital. Here it'll be easy to just like get into our own rhythm and stuff, and I'm excited. Also, she's a good sleeper. So I don't know. I'll keep doing little clips and. Keeping you guys checked in. It's like four or something now, so it's not very late, but it looks so dark. Well, the TV's on, but. <sighs> Y'all like my soundtrack? Yeah. Soothing dad sounds. Look for it on iTunes. It'll be out soon. But okay, I'm not gonna be on here too long. I'm gonna. You know, enjoy my baby. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for supporting. Okay, we love you guys.